sorry about the mess here. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. The docks look pretty busy this morning. Well, since we did a good job with uh, Captain Kajar and his disloyal crew member, he said that there may be somebody else here along the dock that might want our services. Come on, let's go see what's going on here. Hmm, the East Empire Company. Well, I certainly had a good night's sleep last night. Had to put on this heavier armor for wind. Oh, it's just so cold here. Um, excuse me, sir. I know this place looks horrible. Please, don't hold it against the company. Um, well, I'm not, but why is it so run down? Sad, isn't it? We can't afford to keep the place running since these attacks started. Attacks? Pirates, you see. Oh. Raiding all along the coast, from Hammerfell to Vardenfell. Only the Shatter Shields appear safe. And who are the Shatter Shields? A very powerful family in Windhelm. They run a private shipping operation and would love to have the docks to themselves. Wouldn't surprise me if they were in league with the pirates somehow. Hmm. Do you have any proof of that? Not yet, no. But perhaps an intrepid person such as yourself could help with that? They have a dark elf who oversees their operations, Suverus Atherin. She's meticulous to a fault, and keeps a logbook with every transaction she makes. If it were to somehow end up in my hands, I wouldn't argue. I bet you wouldn't. So what else can you tell me about these pirates? They call themselves the Blood Hawkers. Blood Hawkers. They've been around as long as I can remember, but only recently focused on our ships. A dastardly group. But they're more than simple brigands. Shrewd, clever, not to be trifled with. Why not fight back? Our own security forces are limited, and all the mercenaries are tied up in this ridiculous war. We don't even know their base of operations, and attacking single ships won't really solve the problem. <laughs> all right. All right, then. Yes, I'll see what I can do to help out. All right, come on. Can't believe this is the East Empire Company. Hmm, looks almost abandoned. So, according to our source in there, the building we need to search is right here next door. Hmm, and it's locked. And there are guards walking back and forth. walking off but there's still look this how am I supposed to do this all right what am I thinking I have invisibility potions let me just go up here for a moment and I still haven't had the chance to uh 
make more poison. I thought I would have been headed home by now. But that's alright. I can make do with all these other potions I've got. Let's see here. Uh, I don't really need to be invisible for too long. Here it is. Private property of Severus Atheron. Please return to her if found. All right, so spoke with Master Torborn in the morning, pleased with projects to increase competitiveness of shipping office. Spent afternoon overseeing offices and various paperworks. Moderate lunch and heavy dinner. Punished one of the dock workers for laziness. Two days rations. Empty stomach means less good work for a few days, but he'll work hard from here on out. Moderate lunch and dinner. Correspondence with Uncle Nithorpa in Morrowind. Sadness continues to abound flowing west. Light lunch, no dinner. Reports that our pirate friends are offering to let the company ships through in exchange for gold. We'll need to look into this. Heavy lunch and dinner. Try to get in to see Master Torborn about the potential issues, but he proved too busy tending to his wife and daughter in mourning. Did not wish to intrude. Skip lunch, waiting at the Shattershield house, moderate dinner. Explain situation to Master Torborn. As usual, he did not wish to know the details, only how much money I needed to ensure smooth operations. I depart tomorrow for Dawnstar, hoping to catch the captain at the Wind Peak for his crew's regular festivities. Heavy lunch. Skip dinner in favor of packing. Beginning journey. Plan to be back by the 12th. Return safely, though not unscathed. Bandit attacks delayed the initial travel. Then Stig Saltplank proved to be more uncooperative than I had hoped. Chipped in some additional gold out of my own purse. Some cleverness in the books will see it repaid, and the deal was done. Eight on the road, light meals all around. Hoping word gets back to Stig's betters of our new arrangements before more company ships can make it through. Found the Argonians had completely fouled up the operations in my absence. No surprise there. Need to see to the old one's skooma supply. That should keep them motivated. Heavy lunch and dinner. All right, let me take that. It's a... Huh. I can't get 
get to this this lock box back here. All right. Oh, look, a coin purse. Might as well six gold. Hmm. All right. It looks like whoever works here in this office hasn't come in yet. All right. That's empty. All right. Let's get out of here. Hello. By the hist, if I don't get something soon, I don't know how I'll get through the week. Are you all right? No, I'm not. I feel like my scales are clawing into me. Maybe you could help an old Argonian out? I heard some of the sailors talking about how they stashed a bottle of double distilled skooma in the Nissus Corner Club. I just need a taste. Mm. Forget it. Hist spit on you. Yeah, and I'm gonna spit back, too. I would not complain if you return with some skooma. Office. If you give me the logbook, I'll have proof of Shattershield's treachery. I've got the log book. How did you get it? No, never mind. I probably shouldn't know. No, you shouldn't. I see. It looks like Severus has been traveling to Dawnstar to meet with a pirate crew there. Get to Dawnstar and see what you can find out about these rogues. I'd wager they won't be too far from the tavern. <laughs> Try to find out where their fortress is. The captain, Stig Saltplank, has to know something. All right. All right, Omar. Let's get out of here. All right, here we are in Dawn Star. Here to talk to Stig Saltplank. I'm not gonna, even gonna comment on how unusual that name is. Excuse me, ladies. Oh, you know what? I do need to pray. Let me do that before I go inside. Zenithar. Strengthen me. And what have you got for sale today? Resistance to frost. Launching. Alright, not interested in that. Let me meditate a little bit here. Choose Magicka. anything nah, I need to just keep working on my skills here Thank you, Zenithar. Come on in. Just stoke the you fire. You beasts are the worst. Take a seat and get the cold out. Come now, dearie. Surely we aren't all that bad. Did you change your mind? <laughs> You're always welcome to join us. Now drink it and shut your filthy mouths. I was hoping you wouldn't oh, notice me. But no thank you, I'm... Working on some other things right now. I'm not interested. I see. I'll be here if you change your mind. Yeah.
excuse me. What are you looking at? Have you heard of a pirate crew called the Blood Hawkers? Ha! Ah, heard of them? I've been captain in a crew of them for well on nine years now. What's it to you? Lots of gold to be had plundering ships. Aye, the war keeps the Empire and the locals too busy to worry about us. Halden calls it our golden age. I was and who is Halden? Our secret ingredient, if you will. A battle mage of fearsome cunning. Why would I do that? Runs the blood hawkers. Make sure the battles end right side up. And where would I go to join up? Well, I can't just tell that to any skeever that washes up. From the look of you, I'm guessing you're more looking to cause some trouble for the horkers. <laughs> well, do I have to beat it out of you? Nah, it would be my pleasure! Come on, let's see what you're made of! Someone there? Get out of Do something! I'll try oh, and make what? You quick. Give up on Get out of you! Never should have come here. Guys, this you'll need to do better than that. wasn't exactly how I was expecting things to turn out. Alright, so here we got some Blood Hawker orders. Stig, you and your crew must move quickly. The company is attempting to resume shipping routes from the Sentinel to Windhelm. From Sentinel to Windhelm, you can likely intercept off the shore of Dawnstar returned to Yafit's folly, folly when you've handed them, handled them, and I'll have your cut with more instructions. Halden. Hmm, look at this blood hawker sword. Oh, I'm sorry about the mess here. Some fancy armor. Hmm, look at that battle axe. All right, Omar. Think we're done here. It was good work in there. All right. Back in Windhelm. Let's see what's going on now. Adelaisa, I'm sorry. Sorry isn't good enough, Orthus. There's a lot of gold at stake here, and sniveling isn't gonna get it back. I've got a top man on the job right now. He should be returning any moment. This must be him, then. Finally, someone around here that can get things done. Since we're short on soldiers, you'll be coming with us, too. No arguments. Oh, really? Anything else you want to say? <laughs> so you are certainly full of yourself, lady. But anyhow, I do have some information for you. Their leader is a battle mage named Halden. Halden? I've heard of the man, but Halden. never guess he'd join up with some pirates. This could be even more dangerous than I thought. Head to the ships. We'll plan the assault on the way. All right, I hope you're ready, Omar. Let's 
sir. You're the one who's coming to Jaffet's Folly with us, right? Yes. You ready to go? I'm ready. Let's go. All aboard. Hmm, look at this. Well, here we are, we think. Have we reached Yafit's Folly? Hard to say. The weather's taken a bit of a turn here. Halden's been known to obscure his hideaways with magic. If we take care of him, the way should be clear to properly assault the island. And is that my job? You've shown yourself useful so far. All these lunks are too afraid of Halden to head in before the fog's cleared. So, if you're willing to perform one more service for the company, we could put this matter behind us for good. Take out Halden, and we'll handle the rest. All right. Omar, we have our orders. Kill. Saw something. Mm, mud crabs. Like I'm wondering how I could have possibly missed that. Let's go up this way and uh, be on the lookout for an alchemist station. I kind of rushed coming here. Somebody in here. favorite poisons. I didn't realize I had made so many.
looks like a dead hen. Wizards? Hmm. Now that's power. But they got that secret magic. You turn wood to gold. Yeah. Wish I could turn wood. Let's make sure there are no treasures in here that Orion might want. I'm not sure I want to count on them having bad eyesight. Let's go ahead and go invisible. With three bears down, the orc did frown and bid the elf goodbye. For none could know, twas not for show, and someone had to die. <laughs> You're right about that, Mr. Blood Hawker. I should um collect this armor. I'm not sure which way. So wait a minute, we came up these stairs. Alright, so it must be through this door. That's too bad, this was a red god. Not tough enough, though. All right, so was there anything else up here? I 
suppose we'd be heading back down. Oh. Okay, we can go down or up. Alright, let's go down. This might be taking us right back to where we started out, but let's see what's down here. And just remember we can go back up. Just gonna fight these guys outright. <laughs> Is someone there? What was that? Now you're mine. Get him. Oh. That's all you got. <laughs> you won't get the best of me. <laughs> Wait to count out your coin. Omar. Oh, uh, you won't get the rest of me. Uh. I hope you don't mind. Mm. Delicious. this jade lady this might be something Orion might want Yaffet himself. Yaffet's journal. A smaller band than was expected joined with me, departing Dawnstar. Apparently the local word is that this island is unfit for any sort of habitation, owing to spirits and ill-favored weather. No matter, more space for the loyal few. Though the building of the citadel may prove to, to be time consuming. This first winter was difficult with the abandonment of many men and women to return to their families on the mainland. A culling of the herd let us lose the faithless, the weak, and those who lacked the fortitude to persevere. The stories of ghosts inhabiting this place are just stories. They frighten away more of those who would keep who would weep like children when their shadows flicker in the firelight 
me and my closest remain ever vigilant. I find little need for additional company. The cold and winds seem to finally have driven off the last of those who would fancy themselves to be my compatriots. I have no need of their indolence. Let those who look upon Yafet's fortress be afraid and know the great man who conquered the accursed island. Now, even my more trusted go-betweens have stopped making their regular deliveries of food and supplies to the fortress. I must now become self-sufficient and farm the land as my father did. The rocks are unyielding, but my grain grows short. But I will not abandon my greatest creation. I will weather the storm and fend off the ghost and bite into the wind such that all might sing songs of my great settlement. I thought he said there were no ghosts. I'm starting to think the stories of the ghosts may have been a kernel of truth to them or else it's simply the hunger talking. The ghosts are speaking to me more now. The more of this ice moss that I eat, the more clearly I can hear them. They are telling me it was a mistake to come here, as if I didn't already know that. Oh, gods help me. Hmm. I'll take this. Walkish sword of crystals. Tell you, if not for this skeleton key, this would be a hopeless task. It wasn't a giant spider up in here. Wait, what is this? Oh, slaughterfish scales. I'll take those. All right, so I think it's up to the top then. And perhaps that's what Halden will be. Once was a woman as fair as an evening of springtime in Old Stros Mackay. This must be Halden. Mead, mead, mead. Kill him to get some beer every now and then. Stupid bees and their stupid honey. Health. 
told him to just hand over the gold, but did he listen? Oh, no. They always have to fight back. Alright, let's try to ravage the hill, then. He still doesn't know I'm here. Trying to take away his magic, huh? All right, Halden. Oh, look at this. This is Alakia Battle Mage armor. Definitely want to take this. A red god. I should have known. All right, um. Let's see, is there anything in here I can disenchant? see it I think I've got his key now come on let's go You know it, Omar. It's gotten lost. I I've got to go on, though. Give up on your still can. Get him. This way, come on, Omar. Oh, true Nords never back down. Mm. Look out. Alright, he's been silenced. Oh, and you cut his head off. Alright. Come on. Is someone there? Oh! There you are. 
mercy. Mm. I guess that was the mercy. There's somebody else over here. A fight. Get him! Kill him! Alright, so if I jump down here, will I be Is someone right, there? Let me not jump down there. Oh well he just did. Damn you. Alright, oh that's it. Alright. I think we're done. Adelaisa. There you are. Yep. I've killed Alden, or Halden, or whatever his name is. Impressive work. We started the attack once you made the fog scamper away like that. Hope you didn't catch any of the fire. We can head back whenever you're set. There's celebrating to be done. Are you ready to go? Yes, let's go. All aboard! That was uh, Omar back there. Hope he made it. What? What? Now watch me unlock this and end up in jail. I thought they wanted to celebrate. Gods have busted through. Oh boy. Orthus. You're not supposed to be in here. Oh Lord, I knew it. Before you call the guard. You're not supposed to be in here. Oh. Alright, we'll have to come back later. Come on. Last warning. Leave now. Hurry. Oh, hello, God. What time is it anyway? We just have to wait. Well, good morning, Orthus. We're so grateful for your help. Good. The Pirate Haven has been destroyed. I can't express how much easier you've made my job. Maybe Adeliza will finally ease up, but I expect she won't. Ah, yes. Your pay. The company thanks you for your services. Should we ever be able to help you, stop by. All right, well, oh, 1500. I'll share that. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. So, Orthus, we may be able to strike up a deal. I own Zamora's alchemy shop. I think we could come up with an arrangement that would be mutual, beneficial to both of us. Why don't we sit down and have a conversation. <laughs>